What are you trying to do? Kill me? That would be easier. Well, how come you want us to meet me here? Because I didn't want to be at your place, the one you still live in with your father. Well, see, if that like would be homeless. Hmm. Perhaps if you were homeless, you wouldn't be so fat. Nice. Been a good day at work, has he? Work? What would you know about work? You work in retail. <laughs> You're in your 30s. And you've got a job of a 17-year-old virgin, which does make sense because you fuck like one. It's just like a freaky hormonal thing happening right now. What the fuck, eh? Hey? Shut the fuck up. I told you I wanted things to change, didn't I? And what have you done to change them? Anything? You've done fuck all. Fuck all. And I've had enough. Yeah. I've ended it. Well, hey, 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 you're not joking, are you? Oh, my God! Listen here, you thick fuck! I'm ending this completely ass relationship because it's beneath me. You're beneath me. I mean, come on. Look at the state of you. You look like shit. You've gone so downhill. I can't even think what attracted me to you in the first place. You just... Wow, it took you a whole eight minutes to resist calling me. I'm guessing you're calling to grovel. Look, Jasmine, I'm really sorry we don't end it, but I can be a better man. I can actually be good enough for you. Bored now. Well, piss off, then! Really? Oh, Jasmine, you're not being fair now. We're over. Stop pestering me! Hello? 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 Stop calling me, freak! Jasmine, I need to talk to you. You need to leave me alone. Oh, come on! What? Jasmine, why aren't I good enough for you? Because you're a tit. So just delete my number and stop calling me. <sighs> Jasmine, sorry, but...
Just... Fuck off! Decline! Decline? Badly need to talk to you. I know what he's met, usual place. See you soon. Jasmine dumped me. Fuck a duck. Hey, anyway, I'm glad you know you're out on that bear trap. You're stuck in there for a long time. I'll take me out after you. Yep, yeah, she dumped me. Oh. My head's battered, man. I can't think straight about anything. Listen, I'm gonna get you so pulled, like right now. Look, go chat her up over there. I don't, I, I don't think I'm ready for that. Of course you are! Go on, chop, chop! Be the best way of getting over Jasmine. Move! Go on. Hi. Hi. I'm Ryan. Um, and you are? Zoe. Zoe, that's a nice name. Um, do, do you know, I, I, I was just thinking, like, I mean, you seem like a, a nice person and stuff like that, so I just wanted to just come over here and uh, ask you if I could interest in, well, interest inviting you out for perhaps a, a spot of sex. Food! I meant food. I mean spot of food, not like sex or anything like that. I'm not saying that you're not shagworthy, because, well, you so are shagworthy. But, I mean, who'd ask for, like, a, a spot of sex anyway? I mean, you know... Not me, I mean, you know, sounds stupid, really. I'd rather have a bucket. Bucket full of sex for me, please. A weird looking bucket, though. I'm sorry, love. He's, he's having a bit of a bad time at the moment. He's entering in the right place. Um, I've just been dumped. Yeah, I suppose you can see he's not feeling all that at the moment. Yeah, we were together for 10 years. Oh, not us. Him and a girl. I'm straight and single. You fucking bitch. Okie dokie, we're just gonna leave now. Sorry, love, it's okay. not you, it's me. Are you okay? I think that could have went better. Yeah, there's definitely room for improvement. <sighs> but I've got the perfect place to take it to practice. Be prepared to tap some ass. Oh, flat as a fart, that. Ryan McKenzie, welcome to the wonderful world of rebound. <laughs> 